What is happening everybody? My name is Seven and welcome back to another Yeti hunting video. Now I hope that you enjoy this video and I hope that it does help you of course complete all of the solo challenges. If you don't know anything about them please go and check out step one and two. However this could technically be considered step one because it is all about the cipher and the disc that you have to collect which then helps you find everything else. However we can just skip that I made that boo boo and we can just carry it on because you can do any of these in any order. Now when you're in the game you want to go on to challenges and as you will see you will be at season one week six out of six that is what i'm currently doing at this moment in time and it says hints found find all of the hints for the yeti location three out of five now in this video i will be showing you how i turned that from two to three and we will be finding what is known as the cipher which is what helps set the locations around the map which then fundamentally actually support us aid ourselves basically finding uh the the overall yeti experience so what happens is you do each of these steps each of these steps then give you coordinates and they leave you a marker on the map these markers then come together and they mark an x spot on the map itself where you will then find hopefully the yeti itself to then going and kill the yeti so follow each of these steps and of course you will then complete these solo challenges then make your way there if you've already done this then absolutely wonderful so bloody happy that you've done that i am very very happy you've managed to do such a thing because i know a lot of people already have these this video is more for people who haven't completed it as of the moment now we are in inca camina at this moment in time down the bottom left hand side at probably the most popular spawn in this area which is where we are just right now in the inca camina Charlie. Now, Inca Camina Charlie spawns right next to Nevomendo Lamorio. I think that's the thing I can't pronounce it very well, which is the highest peak in Bolivia. Everyone has had to have jumped off this and at least visited it. It's an amazing place. But you want to follow this road down. Now, when you spawn a vehicle or a, helico or a helicopter in from Inca Camina Charlie, it does spawn it on this corner annoyingly. So you have to walk down here and collect it anyway. It's better to spawn a helicopter if you can. But you want to follow this road down. And at this junction, at approximately around this location, which is a latitude of minus 20. 4317 and a longitude of 66.3660 and that was a minus 66 by the way so just down here at this thing right next to san martin mountain hut what you want to do is you want to fly down i've already set a marker and down at this location we're going to find a yeti hunter and we're going to find a unidad soldier now in the arms of one of these individuals there will be or right next to them a basically a cipher which is what is used to then break up all the codes that we are finding in these locations such as the, the yeti hunter who was on the cliff edge and the yeti cave which i've already covered so far in the previous episodes so we just land here and it'll look like this in the area you'll see that there's a vehicle with a with a dead soldier just over there like that and we're in this area here where we are just standing right now beautiful location absolutely love inca camina very very much so we'll see this i mean have a look around so we've got a vehicle and there should be a cipher somewhere that's just a fuel tank we've got the binoculars and we've got a we've got a dead soldier who looks like he's choking himself uh, very interesting so he's parked up and then we've got another dead body here let's see what this is what's this so that's his hand and we've also got a we've got a radio and once again he's dead and it looks like he's been clawed up or he's been shot it looks like he's taken up yeah he's taking a bullet to the head he's been shot in the head so if we come over this way and here we have the yeti hunter so this is the exact same style of character that we found earlier on in the cliff with the rope etc and then we have the unidad soldier now when you come here if you haven't already been here it will unlock and it will then change to whatever stage you are already at so if you haven't found this hint this hint will then be unlocked it will notify you and it will obviously help you then uh, complete this challenge so this is the unidad soldier and as you can see right there it's the cipher and you can see obviously it's got a set of numbers and letters etc on it i don't know if we can pick it up i'm going to click x and see if we can i don't think we can pick it up it's not letting me pick it up as of the moment so it's not letting me pick it up but that is the cipher that we utilize and this is obviously technically stage one because you would come here and then you would um, actually utilize this to find the other locations so by looking at this you've then unlocked that section and you can see all these footprints and things around and this is ideally let's like say it's step one of it all so you've got the, the unidad soldier you've got the yeti hunter another unidad and another unidad around this area it's a beautiful location unfortunately so much death 
death had to be brought to it but this is just a very very quick one guys this doesn't lead anywhere after this one so this is just simply complete one of the hints and i hope that this has helped you obviously find it as well just to be 100 percent sure we are in the inca camina bottom left hand side and you just want to zoom in onto the zigzaggy road and where we are stood approximately around this area you will find this and you will then complete one of the five hints that you need to complete for the solo challenge so i hope this has helped you if it has please smash a like on the video and of course if you have anything else you would like to add or any ideas for other videos you would like to see from me please let me know in the comment section below because my name's been seven also known as martin Lee wood lacking comment on all that you love take care of yourselves oh.